everyone welcome back to my youtube channel um i'm actually like filming this video this clip like from the end of the video but i'm gonna put it at the start um so i'm filming a get ready with me today i'm gonna show you like how i do this really basic natural makeup look and then i've showed you how i've curled my hair and then i'm picking out an outfit for you guys to see so the next clip's gonna be me like without makeup on and like beforehand just in case you guys are confused but yeah also I think I say it in the clip but I'm just saying like I'm not a makeup artist I'm not trying to be I'm not a hairstylist like I'm just showing you guys what I do and like how if you wanted a more of a basic natural kind of look then maybe you'll like this video but yeah I hope you guys enjoy it's really annoying because my mirror's here so like if I am looking forward it's because I'm literally like looking at myself also, how cute is my outfit? I got this set from uh, Zara the other week. So if you guys live near Zara, go and get this. And I just clip my hair back so I can do my makeup. I have like the tiniest bit of my style up left. And I'm going out for lunch today with my friend. I'm so excited. I feel like I've literally like been out so much since we're allowed to go out and like sit outside. I just hate getting cold. Morning and evening I wash my face with the CeraVe. I think I might be saying that wrong. It's just like a cleanser and I just wash it with that. I literally have the worst skincare routine but I can't actually like put much on my skin. That's how I'll get a breakout. Like if I leave my skin, or not like leave it but like do as minimum as possible that's when I don't get breakouts so I literally just do that and I used to only use makeup wipes but they're not actually good for your skin and they're not good for the environment so I swapped to that and then before I put my makeup on I just put this on my skin and again I use this because it's like quite light that like if I put a thick moisturizer on my skin that is when I will get spots so I just put this on because also it helps with my foundation like, if I don't put this on first, my foundation just goes weird. Um, so yeah, I put this on all over my face. Literally just like that. Um, I think I'm going to mix these. I use these, um, look at this stain. <laughs> these Chanel foundations. I literally love Chanel's foundation. Like, I just think it's so nice. I've tried others before. And like I just don't like it on my skin. Also, like please, like don't hate for how I apply my makeup as well. I literally put put on the back of my hand, and then I just put dots all over my face like this. And then I'm gonna mix them because it's just that's not really like full coverage. Not that like I really want a full coverage, but that's kind of just like a tinted moisturizer. And I literally have like a tiny amount of this other one. But, few dots around my face. I like don't put makeup on my nose either because now it's like warmer my freckles have come out and like I just kind of leave it on my nose and then I'm gonna use this Real Techniques brush and just literally like blend it into my skin. As you can see it's like quite light but I really like that. Okay so I just have blended that in sometimes I do go over it with my real techniques beauty blender just because then it like goes into my skin more sometimes I find with a brush like it looks like you I don't know I feel like it doesn't really blend that well so I normally just go over it like this the funny thing is like this day to day not that I wear makeup every day I literally do this like when I go out like this, this makeup routine I'm doing now is no different to when I go out, like proper go out. But at least I'm always the quickest one to get ready. I use the Maybelline Instant Anti-Age Eraser. I just use it for like contour. I think it actually is a concealer. Oh yeah, it says multi-use concealer. Um, but I really want the um, Charlotte Tilbury contour stick I think it's cool but like to be honest this is like as good I like put dots there and then dots here 
and a few dots there like that again like i don't really use much of this but i think it really helps and then i use look how <laughs> dirty my setting spray is i just wet my beauty blender because i feel like it definitely is much easier to use a blender when it's wet and like it just goes nice like you can't really even tell but i just think it looks a bit better and it gives you a bit of color as well okay and then we go up here and blend it in big lip i think that looks quite nice i'm literally so sad i had um on holiday booked with my friends to go to Marbella and literally yesterday it got cancelled like I really kind of thought it was going to happen this year but no and it was for July like that's so long away I literally don't know what to do but I think like everyone and myself is just so in need of a holiday like imagine just being in the sun drinking vodka and eating, is it Lay's, the yeah, foreign vodka, I think it's Lay's. After bit, like tanning all day, that is just literally the best feeling in life. Okay, so I'm just literally blending everything in now. Okay, and then I do go over that with this Hula Caramel Bronzer. This is literally incredible. I used to have the, I don't think I have it in here anymore. The like original one, I think. I don't know what that's called. But like this shade is so much nicer. I feel like it's more natural, so I put that on. And I literally just go over where I put that um, concealer stuff to contour. So I just go over like this, just to give me a more bronzed face. Does anyone else like call such weird faces when they do their makeup? But like I'm gonna watch this back and be like, what the hell am I doing? I think my mouth is just open all the time. I think I literally go overboard with the bronzer, but I quite like it. As long as it's like blended out, then it's fine. I saw this video as well, I think it was on a TV programme. And like, you're meant to always with makeup go up. So, like, with bronzer, you're meant to like push it up like this. There we go, there's a makeup tip for you guys. <laughs> Just in case none of you knew that. I said to do that. For brows, I literally use this. I will like tag everything that I use below, but like a primer, eye pencil, eyebrow pencil. I don't need to tag that below, but like I think that this and then like the Chanel foundation and whatever, I'll leave all links below. And then with this eyebrow brush, I just um, brush them all that up. And like, I don't actually want the like the whole laminated look, but my they're, they're just quite big and they just grow like crazy fast. And then I use the pencil end and I just kind of fill out the end part. Like I don't really touch here. I just make the end in the middle. I can even see it depends. <laughs> a little bit more structured. I really want to like go and get my eyebrows dyed. Oh my god, funny story. My friend and I um, went to this lady to get our eyebrows hennaed, like a henna tattoo. Oh my goodness, I literally looked like I had Sharpie, like all over my face i was crying to my parents on the phone and i made my dad was out drinking with his friends and i made him like where i live we like live in the bottom end of town and he lives like he was out at the top end of town and i made him run home because <laughs> i was just crying because i hated my eyebrows but funny thing is like i actually loved my eyebrows a few days after it was just the first couple of days I was mortified. I was like, I'm not going to work and all this stuff. But 
like now I look back at photos of it a few days after like where it's kind of worn out and also that the night when I am um, husband died I made my mum come round too and we were like washing my brows with like um head and shoulders because that's like gets rid of dye we were scrubbing them like I was literally like this trying to scrub it off my eyebrows were so painful they were so red I was just trying to get some colour off and I don't even think I need to check but I don't even think Ellen hated hers like she just suits everything and she looked nice I just literally they were like this I might insert a photo but I probably won't because I'm literally crying and there's like snot down my face it's disgusting but yeah it was so funny well it wasn't funny at the time but just gonna add this to the end of the brush to put them in place let's go onto mascara I might um like fast forward or clip this part out because I don't think my face my concentration face is gonna be very nice what is this L'Oreal Lash Paradise. To be honest, any mascara is good. I used to have the Benefit one, but like this is as good to be honest. And then I just literally apply. I don't put um, mascara on my bottom lashes. I don't know if anyone does. To be honest, all of my friends have eyelash extensions, or like if we go out, they'll put on like strip lashes. But again, I I don't suit any of them either. So I'm literally just here with my mascara. That's my super basic natural everyday makeup routine. I only really like um, curl it in quite big bits. Like I prefer the like bigger curl. Just wrap it round and leave it on for a while. Group it together hold it there for a bit and then I just let it drop and like this section I'm just going to curl it I might put it in two actually because this side but like this so like that kind of amount literally like that and then I just leave it on for like a couple of seconds Before I go out, I think I'll probably brush them through because I actually quite like it when it's even less of a curl. Okay, so I am dressed now. I'm wearing this white. This was actually in one of my hauls um, that I filmed before. With these PLT like split hem jeans and then I got these new um, McQueen's in their white, so yeah. Join with me, Fisty! <laughs> we got a little glass of rosé. Look how cute this place is. Sorry, are we in Ibiza? <laughs> <laughs> I got the chicken Caesar salad and bacon. And Ellen got um, chicken skewers. Look how lovely Ellen looks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> guys, we just got some more drinks. Taste test. I've got it on my lip. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 